Working in the Functions tab of Tea Time, you will find that the Cloud System Settings and Storm System Settings uh, located in uh, that particular uh, tab. The Cloud and Storm Settings are very similar, uh, and I'd like to explain them both at the same time. You have the ability to create a time a Cloud system would be active. Right now, duration is 250 minutes. You can decrease that. You can actually highlight it also. Um, and I'll just change it to 50 minutes. Tab out of that. And by creating the duration of 50 minutes, I can then choose six levels of intensity from soft to heavy. And what that does is that basically is changing the percentage of decrease and increase of the LEDs within the 24-hour trace that you're uh, running and uh, how intense it is. Uh, heavy is going to be uh, 0 to 100 percent decrease. Uh, you'll have 10 percent uh, decreases here and there. If you go up to the soft, you might notice a 20 to 30 percent decrease in intensity, uh, not really doing a dramatic effect. Um, but uh, still, nonetheless, doing some slight changes to the uh, light intensity over a 50-minute period of time. Again, we can pick the royal blue, blue, white, or red that we want active. We also have the ability to have a duration always. And duration always is essentially saying that when you activate the cloud system settings on the remote and the fixture, you will have cloud systems as a possibility all of the time. Um, same going with the storm system settings. You again can change the duration that you would like it. Now the storm system essentially is the lightning mode and you can change the mild to violent and the mild violent intensity is going to be the amount of flashes, how close the flashes are to each other, um, which um, LEDs are part of that uh, flashing and uh, lightning storm. Right now if we activate the storm setting it will stay on for 34 minutes. It will decrease uh, the uh, LEDs. You'll start getting the flashing. After 34 minutes of being active it will shut down. It'll go back into your regular 24 hour trace. However, duration always is going to give you storm functionality possibilities all of the time. Um, not one that I typically will use uh, just because the random function and the strength of the storms uh, can get to be a little bit more intense than what